Good afternoon, everyone. This is your captain, Steven Asaur, speaking, and this is today's guild war against little boys. So, I don't want to beat little boys, but mystics are mystics, so we got to do it. And uh, we got the the Leia data mine yesterday after the patch. So that's great. Her kit, she's looking really, really strong. Looking like a great counter to Lua, Naquo, even AOL. Look that she just has so much potential. Uh, she's going to be insane. I definitely going to be insane. Because, like, the push-ups, the, the CR, like, um, the cooldown reduction, freaking, the artifact is insane, too. I really hope I get a couple of copies of that. So she, she just has so much going for her, so I'm just, like, ex excited. Hopefully we can get her. I'm at, like, 400 Covenants, so not 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 exactly a pity, but I'm close. So I should be able to get her. Hopefully I can get her day one, but if I don't get her day one, at least I'll be able to get her at the very least. But, uh, this Guild War... I want to win the guild war because I want to get those mystics. Plus, gotta help out some guildies that are interested in custom mystic. I tell people don't summon unless you get you can have you, you can do the full 200. But uh, they say they can do it. Plus, they'll pay. So I'll you know I'll, I'll try to like ease their burden by helping them win guild wars. So let's just do this. Oh, okay, we got a knack wall. So this is gonna be a bit of a toughie. Hmm. I don't want to get reset here, but I think this could be a good AU Fiend game. We don't really care about the um, the bind. We just want to get our S3 off and just like kill this. If we kill the Mercedes, we should be very fine. We're going to also bring, I think we'll bring Elena. Actually, Elena's going to be really good here. Let's bring Elena. What else do we bring? We could bring candy, like, cause, like, um, because if we cleanse the bind, then we can just, like, attack, but, hmm, maybe mitigation would be the play. I think we should bring mitigation. Or we're gonna bring a Destina, make sure to get some heals going, plus a bait for the S2 from Nekwal. We already have a healer, so it kind of it, it kind of doubles up. Like Elena's like a sort of like a burst heal, not exactly like a consistent heal, like we're all in Destina. But I think we'll be okay with just that. So let's uh, we'll go with we'll, maybe mitigations the play. We'll have Euphine just solo everything. We're just gonna take some. We're gonna tank all the damage. Uh, here's my uh, Elena. My first time using her in Guild War after the buff. Like we don't really get opportunities. I'm using her on the um, the Ning Ning artifact for RTA, but if not for RTA, I, I would have used Magaharas. Maybe I, maybe I'll use Magaharas, or I'll just hold, I'll just hold on and use this. But uh, to, high a, a Fres, so we should shouldn't have to worry about um, Nakwal. Hopefully, decent bulk, high speed. We should be able to cut with the S2 passive and the Ning Ning artifact or Magaharas. So. We should be able to cut these two, get that invincibility up. It's kind of useless, I guess, in a way, because, um... Like, the arrow will probably go and strip me, but it's okay. Now for this top team... Hmm... This is a Malona situation right here. Bring Rowana and Pillis. I think we'll bring arrow well because I I need that uh pr protection and a bait for the stene. Moon bunny is okay, but I think m mitigation is the the name of the game here. We really need to get some mitigation going. But I do like the skill nulls and immunity. I I like the skill nulls and immunity so that we can protect ourselves. Because a good S2 off Malona with attack buff, we should be able to do a lot of damage. Not fear death. Seizing victory is seizing the future. Can you even reach the me? skill nulls were pretty safe. A slap will do. Hmm, let's see. 
Let's get rid of their mitigate. Let's get rid of the Silius here. We gotta get rid of the Silius. Rude, ignorant, immoral. These words are too good for you. So unfortunately, we're gonna lose all of our skill nulls. Should I S3 here just in case Stene S3 kills my Eldom? Maybe actually. Let's actually protect. Let's make sure Generous we survive. Rekos. Please protect us. I can hear them. Vengeful voices. Okay, get that S2. We lose our skill nulls. But we are gonna survive no this. Escape. We have a barrier and a revive Ever. buff. That is not I'm a lot of damage, so we're just chilling. I'll teach you a lesson. Sleep? Good sleep. Very good sleep. I'll wrap things up momentarily. I think we need to I think we actually wanna do this. We wanna give you as much damage to the Senya as possible. That also gives us a You? You're just a puppy. Good sleep. Step back. We want to proc the Senya a lot. We want to get those S2s. The be so we might lose the Eldom here. But this will protect. This will get another S2 up. Oh my gosh. Wake up the Silius, unfortunately. So. Okay, wait, that's actually huge. Is that all you had to show me? Let me see. How Does Silius have her are. S? Does she have this it? Is just the beginning. She has her S2, but not her S3. So we, I think Eldom's dead, unfortunately. Unf what are you? How is Eldom still alive? I'll teach you a lesson. My tea is getting cold. Become like the autumn My goodness, leaves. this Eldom is resilient. Or maybe, maybe I'm just gear diffing. Must be brave. Dies to Rowana. Nice, nice, nice. Very nice. We got to keep the Eldom. So Nackle's gonna go here. We're faster than this whole team. That's actually not ideal because we're gonna lose our in invincibility. We resisted the binds how do you like this the stars light our way she reset my she hit my elena and reset are you serious man huh? i protect that's what i do maybe we should let's hit this let's hit um this let's stun her get as much damage as we can get Here I come. Doesn't really matter about a Yuffin getting reset because don't ever ignore oh, the power of because we don't have our S3 just yet. We'll full cleanse the stun. Okay, 28k arrow. It's very hard. Okay. Children of the stars will be saved. Shine forever. Let's S3 here. In the light of the stars. Invincibilities. Try not to feel so indignant. We have Ephra's buff that helped us Another resist the stuff on um, the, the uh <sighs> It helped us resist the seal. Oh, Another S2. Oh wait, no, we Are got reset, that's me? what happened. I actually don't mind hitting this um Unfortunately we don't have our S3 just yet. You encounter me. Oh my gosh, this Nackle has so much. She might reset my AU fiend, and we have our S3. We didn't- oh, it didn't reset. That's huge. That's huge, that's huge. But we do proc the counter, which didn't really help us. That's unfortunate. Can we strip this? Strip the escort? No, we strip the barrier. Call. Unveil your eye of terror. But the, the mitigation is really helping us here, so we don't really care. Look beyond the sky. So we have our Eufin to cleanse. No. We're gonna 
I'm hoping there's no shenanigans here because with trauma we might get one shot by the Mercedes. That actually is a possibility. So let's hope for no shenanigans. All right, we killed her. Can we get that speed? Don't magic for friends me. Okay, good. Now this guy has no damage. The stars light our way. Try not to feel so indignant. Resist the seal, that's good. Stupid trash. Kill the knack wall. Now we don't have to worry about their shenanigans anymore. I protect. That's what I do. We stun the arrow. Those who stray from the path of righteousness shall be punished. No, he can't. Are you me? Huh? I don't even know anymore. Now let's save the soul word for the S3. See? I made it in the nick So even if she's gonna stun me, it doesn't matter. Children of because the stars will be saved. Let's see if we can actually resist it. Or she even have it? Did she have the S3? It feels like she should have it. Good timing. But she might still stun me, even with Ephra's buff. She did it. Another That's very good. So we can be buff because we stripped the barrier. Okay, okay, okay. Then how is this? So the Elena value was sort of there because actually the sky. she also reduces damage taken for um reduces depth for AOE attacks. That's actually really nice. So that really helps in, in case the Mercedes does some bullshit you. on us and the knack wall yeah. as well. It's unfortunate that she can still reset me. Yeah, that knack wall had really high effectiveness, but that's just a uh, gear diff and hats off to him for having such high F on a decent speed. This guy's cook. Oh my gosh, what is this? We could try this, but let me see what other burning towers are. I want to win. Oh, this one looks pretty standard. But we could still do this. This one looks pretty hard to deal with for most people. A lot of people are avoiding him too. So yeah, let's uh, let's go on this one. So this one's pretty easy. We gotta get the Edward to just wreck this. We're gonna have Rumor to deal with the. They will deal with this with this. I guess we could use Elena as our flex pick. And Rimuru, what is Rimuru? So this RG RGB Trinity here, that's pretty nice, that's pretty cool, I love doing that. It always feels so satisfying being able to do like the diverse types. Alright, this one though is a, is a Zeo Cleave, so we're gonna, we are gonna be able to prevent this from cutting. So we're gonna do... We're also immune to silence, so we're not gonna even be able to proc, because we're gonna bring Brom in here. So, does, does... He still might debuff me with a chain of Chiron somehow, but... At the very least, we're not gonna get silenced, and we're hopefully with the AU Fiend passive, Jacko doesn't cut my Brom in, and then we're just gonna silence the whole team, defense break, and hope some big stuff happens. I could also bring my, um, I think Gilius would be actually really good here because she can't die to the Jacko in case Jacko does do some shenanigans. So we're gonna, we're gonna bring, we're gonna bring our Gilius here. She'll also really help us kill that Bellion. And AU Fiend's just our backup in case bad stuff happens. Cause Bellion will just give so many charges to our AU Fiend that we're gonna be chilling. We might not cut with our Elena, but we're just here to just take that uh, reduction of AoE damage. We resisted every debuff, so that's not good. We really need Edward to proc there. At the very least, we still get our immunities up, so in case the, uh, the Cesaria doesn't bomb us. 
We are getting. Wait, does, does, does Edda strip? Shall embrace you. She doesn't strip. That's okay. That's good. I'd like to return now. So Cesaria loses a lot of her value after that first turn, so now we're just chilling. Do we just um go on the run? I think we kill the run here. Although defense bark and S1 is kind of scary, but I think we're gonna get rid of Ron. We didn't even need the fixed damage. I think we'll kill Cesaria here, because just I want to get that Sigurd Scythe healing. Easy one shot. So still immunities. Oh, but she does strip, but unfortunately for you, you didn't land any debuffs. But no, I think S3 is the way I want debuffs. So goodbye. It's actually an Elena video, that's kind of weird. Okay, so I am the Chain of Chiron, universe. don't proc please. Kneel before me. So she, oh she did stun. That's How unfortunate. Get out of my sight? But there's no debuffs for her to full pen, and we're gonna be able to protect ourselves from Come Jacko on, killing Gilius. So we're we're pretty chill here Though actually. It won't make a difference. <laughs> Kill the Bellion. So Jacko's gonna attack Gilius. Can't do more than a third of my HP with damage limiter, so we're safe. Can we attack down? Unconditional loyalty. We kill the Zeo here. We gotta kill that Zeo. Now it's my turn. Remain focused. Can we defense break? Yeah, let's just let's get that defense break. Good defense break. So I don't care if we lose Broman here. Oh, the, no damage at all on this on the Zeo. She stunned me, but we're, that's that's okay because we have damage limiter. We're still alive, but Zeo having no damage that's really good for us. You so We just cleave him back. We got a dual attack to heal up a bit. That's nice. Every darkness has its own distinct shade. Yeah, it's all about picking the right bait. So do we go, do we go on this guy? This guy is cooking with the Leo, but uh, let's see if we can find anything burning here. What's this? Interesting. This could be one. And some people are losing to it. No other burning towers. These are burning, but like they're so close that I think someone else could handle them. So do we do we do this one? Do we do this? Oh, the cooking guy. The other one looks harder. Yeah, I think pe I think people would be able to beat this by like knowing the mechanics. So let's go with the guy that's actually like got some toxic RNG crap going on here. A little bit of lag, but it's okay. All right, so let's see what we can do here. So we really got to get rid of this, of this Selene. This Selene's a bit of a problem. I think Lua would be really good here. We'll bring Lua. I think Gilius would be all right here. If we can get rid of that Senya really fast, that could be good. Although, hmm, her her pass. Oh, not not. We don't have to worry about the passive. But when she does her like attacks, that could be scary with the the pops. But um, we're gonna try. So Lua's gonna get rid of these. What's our last pick here? I can't Hua Young because uh, the Senya has high attack, but uh. 
would Ludica be able to kill? I don't know. But there's also, I think Ludica would be better suited down here. Let's bring Ayufin. Terra Ludica. Yep. I think that's the good that's the plan. So we're oh. Uh, da -da. We're gonna use our Ludica to kill the ammo Ken, and then hopefully just keep her stun locked with Ludica S1s. And Ayufin is our backup just in case. Because we can't af oh we can't afford to like not one shot this ML Ken so hopefully we land the debuffs here so that Ludica does her thing because we're gonna be he's gonna be at full HP because of the Ludica has too so we really need to get those debuffs off now what's our last pick for this top one the Selene is gonna be a bit of a problem I really need to get her out of the way Dark Corvus could be okay too I guess maybe. We could winter, actually. Let's winter this guy. Or uh, we could do a s control, actually. Control would be a lot better, maybe. Let's do some control. I think DDR would be really good here. Because it would help us get a lot of turn cycling going. Help us with like the lowest speed buff with um, DDR, S2... And just like general speed plus the silt, the Gilius S2, we're gonna have a lot of tempo. We're just gonna overrun this guy. We're gonna overrun him. He's not gonna be able to get the good stuff going. Also, a little sneak peek of a little thing I picked up here. But uh, let's uh, let's go. You have no value. So let's make. sleep this. Let's get our let's prevent her from moving. <laughs> and if we get 15% here, it's okay. We have DDR as a backup. I'll be the one deciding how this story now, ends. can we reset the entire no game? Getting away from it. Make peace and accept your fate. We reset Let's everyone. That's very good. Plan. Let's, uh... Who do we go on? Should we kill that? I think we need to kill this. Because we could have DDR sleep the Sanya. Dreams usually meet a bitter end. Is it my turn now? Does Airwolf just have, like no HP? Life or death. Pick your poison. Okay, we're gonna hope we sleep these two. Can we sleep these two? This won't hurt a bit. I guarantee it. Sleep, sleep, sleep. Good we we didn't oh, sleep the, the air arrow, arrow, but that's actually very oh, beneficial for us. We really wanted that actually. Treatment. Because we can have um, Gilius finish off the... Nice. Perfect timing. It looks like now we can just uh, go place. on her. Defense break doesn't really matter here. Worry not. The doctor is in. Good sleep. You really want your blood spilled? So be it. I guess we could hit the Senya. It's on counter set. That's not good. So we give. We're gonna give a barrier to the Celine here. Unconditional loyalty. Oh, we'll just hit. Amazing. Spear will not go until it pierces the heart of my head. That's not good, Art. We're taking a bit of damage here. Do you smell that? that we gotta sleep this. <laughs> good, we slept her. Get that. Okay, we're chilling, we're chilling. Dreams and fantasies. We're so chilling. It looks like somebody forgot their No greed. We don't wanna we don't wanna wake her up. We have a misty buff, we might miss the S2 sleep and wake her up and she's gonna S We reset her so she she doesn't have sleep. The Trust me. I'm a Very nice. I'm that was amazing control my and micro here. So you're making me get my hands dirty. You should feel Finish honored. off with the flare. Very good.
Now, this one's gonna be a bit rough, but let's hope for the best here. If you wish to die. If we land on that uh Rwanda, that'd be amazing. We actually did oh my goodness. We do encounter it and our payra just dies. Oh this this guy has really high damage on his uh Ken. But that's actually okay. I'm so thirsty lately. Cause we just killed the ML Ken here. My leaves are quivering. <laughs> Easy one shot. May the love now our problem here is that the Velian might be a bit of a problem. Good thing she's she's not on Stella Harpa. She was on one just pro Cheval, but she she cleansed her um, anti buff, so that's really good for us because that protects the Belian doesn't have it. No injury on the Belian. That's good because our our Lydica can then. Oh god, that's a Elbrus though. That's actually good though. We got a lot of charges. Now can we stun? Good. We got the stun. We're chilling. And Potion Vial is only cleansing herself. What a, it's very selfish. This uh, Rowana. Here I come. Do we have her S3 yet? Almost that. She, she's zooming. She just lapped the, these two because like she has the full speed bonus now. So that's insane. I can do it too. So we have her S3. Oh, it's gonna be a heal for you, but that's okay. Can we get a stun here? No stun, but that's okay. Who was that? The goddess? Do we kill the Bellion or the Rowana? Let's just kill the let's kill the Bellion. So that we can get no greed. We'll have our um AU feed deal with the Rowana. Oh, she's a bit fast. We didn't get the full penetration. So it would have been better to go on the Rowana, actually. Oh god. We had skill nodes that actually was very helpful for her. Would you like to feel with Is she on counter set? I'll break you. No counter set. We're almost back to another Ludica S3. That's actually kind of insane. May the holy light save us all. I don't even know what you want to see. I hear your heartbeat. My heart is hot in my water. Then give me your blood. Here I come. I don't really oh, they have a little bit of speed on their units, but that's okay. We have our AU feed. You're ready. I'm so thirsty lately. Even stunned. Would you like to oh my gosh, this Ludica just has so many turns. I can't. I hate the darkness. Because it hides your suffering. I see. Soul burn S1. We are chilling. Very clean guild wars. Did anybody die? Let's see if anybody died. Let's hope we get a win here. We're starting to catch up, although they're still ga they're still gaining a pretty good lead. Like someone's been attacking. Someone's attacking me right now. But did anybody die? We did lose Pera. Yeah, she got one shot by the ML Ken. That was kind of cringe, but that was actually we even saved our Broman and Eldam in those fights. That was pretty cool. But yeah, that was the Guild War. Mondays, nothing's new. But I guess this is a Elena Euphine video today. But nothing new for Monday. Wednesday, I'm going to try to see if we can get the Leia. See if we can even do the debut on Wednesday. Since it's not a maintenance Wednesday. And Leia's going to be coming. So yeah. This has been your Kevin Savinasaur. Thanks for coming. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.